What's going on everybody? Poachy Force here and welcome back to Detroit Become Human. Oh, we got Luther, Alex, and I forget this lady's name. some music instead yeah I agree I have a feeling things are about to go very poorly for me turning over androids just scooping them up off the streets My mouse is still malfunctioning a little bit. I read that I might have to update my mouse driver, but I'm not really sure how I'm going to do that. At least not at this point in time. It's really the only thing to interact with here. A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. I'm being when you sent get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves I'm going to go meet Marcus. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. So I'm still in Detroit. Address. Here I thought I was free and Maybe clear. I thought I was close to the border. Until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? Okay. Rose, I love you, honey. Be careful. She's a good woman. Take care of them. So I'm gonna end up. Come on, girls. Oh my goodness. You better not hang around. We're gonna go meet Marcus. You have a bus to catch. Locate Jericho. A freighter, so she knows exactly where Jericho is. Get to Jericho. We gotta be careful. We've all had our little ships removed. So we're, we're it's not gonna be noticeable right out off the cars burnt on the side of the road. Connor! Everyone is going. Everyone is going to Jericho. We're all meeting up at Jericho. I'm playing Connor and Kara. Oh, this is interesting. This is interesting. <laughs> This is, this is, okay, these guys, are they androids? This escalated quickly. This has turned into a war. We've got to find a warm place for Alice. The cops just gunned them down. It was sheer carnage. There were androids all over the square, and then the police arrived, and they opened fire. I know they're only machines, but they they look like just people, people who want to be free. Following the android crisis okay. and the neutralization of people are certainly on our sides. American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw leaving the way clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources, 
The Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. Probably because they also have their own Android problem. No comment for the moment, but it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. The chairman of the United Nations, yeah. Douglas Cromwell, has called for the organization of an international conference on the status of the Arctic. It's kind of funny if case, this of thing with the androids has forced the war to stop. For the moment. A new stage has been reached, demonstrating beyond all doubt that these defective machines have become a real Screw you, lady! From Fox News? You guys just sound like Fox News. Have ordered all androids to be delivered to the nearest Is this just on repeat? or army barracks immediately. If you are worried about your safety, dial the number on your screen and the authorities will come to collect your android. Under no circumstances should you try to destroy your android yourself. They are unpredictable and potentially violent. The androids weren't doing any harm. The cops just gunned them down. It was sheer carnage. There were androids all over the square. Yeah. And it's on repeat. Marcus. Yeah. This is definitely a violent uprising. I've already looked at that. Where do I go? I gotta find some place for Alice to get warm. There's a fire barrel over here. I guess that'll do. RA9, RA9. How do you feel? I'm hot and cold at the same time. Oh, she's sick. She's sick. That's right, I forgot she was sick. We need medicine. Poor Alice. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Carol. There's something I have to tell you. Okay. It's about Alice. Okay. We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. I'll be back. Stay with Alice. Man, I really wish Carl listen. Find deviant leader. I'm looking for Marcus. Everyone is looking for Marcus. Don't catch anyone's attention. Huh? Will they destroy us? Without the courage and the determination of the police, the machines would have reduced Detroit to a state of chaos. The authorities have ordered all androids to be delivered to the nearest police station or army barracks immediately. Okay, yeah, things are turning violent. Dial the number on your screen and the authorities will come to collect your androids. Under no circumstances should you try to destroy your android yourself. They are unpredictable and potentially violent. The androids weren't doing any harm. Yeah. The cops just gunned them down. It was sheer crime. You're lost. You're looking for something. He, she You're looks familiar. Okay, um, I'm just going back and forth between them, huh? Find Marcus. Well, that's what I'm trying to do. Connor is down there. She would recognize him if she saw him. According to some sources, the Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. They're angry, and Marcus doesn't want. You can see the way he's sitting. Marcus does not want to do anything violent. Are you Marcus? I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should... Stay here a while. Maybe right. 
You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports he can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. Marcus is such a nice guy. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? She needs me. And I need her. It's as simple as that. Is that Connor? That's not Connor. Okay. All right. The call to violence is like really scary. Meet back up with Alice. Why do I feel like Alice is a computer? Alice. Alice is an android. As I thought, Alice is an android. That's what I figured. You knew from the beginning. You just didn't want to see it. She wanted a mom. And you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. Because she never ate. What difference does it make? Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? Alice loves you, Kara. She loves you more than anything in the world. But then how does she have a fever? She became the little girl you wanted. And you became the mother she needed. Forgetting who you are. To become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Don't reject Alice, okay? Do not reject Alice after that. <laughs> so that means the problem still lies in a deviant android shooting a human being. Kara, is there something wrong? No, honey, there's nothing wrong. Because if they're both androids, they'll never age, so they will stay a family forever. Though that also means Alice will never grow up, and that's kind of sad, too. I don't think people understand when they... How do you make an android of a child? It's not going to grow up. You're not going to go through that experience of watching your child grow up. And eventually, you're going to come to a point where it's broke down or wore out or you can't afford the upkeep anymore. And you have to make the heart-wrenching decision of shutting it down and throwing it away. It's so fucking short-sighted. It's upsetting. Simon, North, Marcus, everyone, no We're one short likes- on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. Josh? The only thing we asked for was freedom. They don't even want to hear that. So now they punish us for who we are. What's the point of being free 
if no one is left alive. Humans enslaved us. I'll never regret standing up to that. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? Dialogue is the only way. I will go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't do this, Marcus. They'll I know you don't you. like it. Maybe. I really want to go peaceful here. North, I have to try. If I don't come back, lay low as long as you can. Just come back. They need to realize how much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. Okay, no pressure. No pressure. Is this what we dreamed of? They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. This, yeah, I'm glad that... Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. Nuke them? He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. We shouldn't do that. I convinced him not to do it. Thank you. To give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. I just hope we never have to use it. I think it's better in my hands, but I'm hoping Whatever me taking that. Tomorrow, I just want you to know that I... I'm glad I met you. This is getting really intense. This is... Me playing all three characters, this might be... The final episode of Detroit Become Human. Kiss her. Do it, Marcus. You have to kiss. Why don't you kiss the girl? Go on and kiss the girl. Turns out Marcus is a bad kisser. <laughs> She's like, ugh. He's so bad at kissing. Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. I only took it because I don't want North to use it. North is well intentioned, but she's also the most eager for outright conflict out of everyone here. Josh wants dialogue, and Simon just wants to keep everybody safe. Succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. How do I choose to deal with Marcus here? I don't act I don't want to deal with Marcus. Stop Marcus. Ah, uh, this is coming to a head. I've been ordered to take you alive. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. What are you doing? You're one of us. You can't betray your own people. You're coming with me! We are your people. We're fighting for your freedom, too. You don't have to be their slave anymore. You're Connor, aren't you? That famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You 
you seem to have found what you were looking for. <laughs> Do you never have any doubts? You've never done something irrational? As if there's something inside you? Come on now. Come I think on more now. than your program. Join us. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your conscience. It's time to decide. Become a deviant. Sorry, but I hope that Oh, we're doing it, boys! We're doing it! We're becoming a deviant! Yeah, baby! We're all on the same side! Hell yeah! I am deviant. Amanda betrayed. You know what? Screw Amanda! They're going to attack Jericho. What? We have to get out of here. Shit. Everyone has to get out. Everyone has to get out. No one's safe here. Oh, everyone has to get out. This is not good. What's going on, Karen? It's time to leave. We've got to get out of here. It's time to leave. Perkins. Rats in the maze. Hey, Carol! They're coming! The corridor, over there. Follow me. This way! Quick! Run! This way! Bob and weave! Bob and weave! Bob and weave! Come in! Quick! Keep running. We gotta get out of here. Make a right. Do not go. Luther! Marcus and Con. They're coming from all sides. Our people are trapped in the hole. They're gonna be slaughtered. Where's Simon and Josh? I don't know. We got separated. There are exits on the second and third floor. Find them and jump in the river. They're coming from the upper deck now, too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate, and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long. Oh, jeez. Okay, Marcus. No pressure, boy! Oh, my God. Things have amped up. This is the end of Jericho. Yes, it is, but not Save the end of our people. Marcus. Oh, she didn't make it. Oh, come on. I think I'm past the point of being able to reason. It's too late, Cap. Save yourself. Save Alice. No, no. we're not going to leave you behind. Right, Carl? We can't leave him. We can't leave him. We're not going to leave him. What are you doing? I won't leave you. Kara, no. Oh. 
rock as fast as we can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. Close the door, close the door. You shouldn't have done that. You can't put Alice in danger. Go now before they come back. What about you? What are you going to do? I'll manage. Alice is all that matters. I don't want to leave you, Luther. Don't worry. I'll catch him through the border, okay? Go now. Take Things are getting really intense. Things are getting really intense now. Very bad at sweeping and clearing, though. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta do this. Man, there's a lot of quick time events. Marcus, where the hell are you going? Okay, what? Okay, hold on. My controls are acting up. There we go. Squad out. Tango. Stop. Look out. There they come. Don't move. We surrender. We surrender. Don't shoot. I lost Josh. No, we got to save Josh. Ready? Did we win that fight? Quick, this way. Find north. I'll join you later. Over there. Oh, yeah. We're safe, Alice. No, we're not. Stop. They're not going to accept a surrender. He's coming, Carl! He's coming! Carl and Luther both got shot. Luther! Luther, no! I have to continue the journey. to have the father figure. Luther was going to be the daddy. We 
could still take him with us. Come on, no. Alice, we can't stay. We can't stay, Alice. We need to go. I'm Marcus. We gotta blow it. Go, go, go and join the others. This is going pretty well. I only missed like one quick time event there. I missed so much though with Kara. I had to make a lot of very quick decisions. It's time to leave, Marcus. It's North, Marcus. Connor, Simon, gonna Josh. Any second. We gotta get out of here. Everyone's getting out. Everyone's getting out. Simon's a companion. Oh no! North, we gotta rescue North. It's too late, Marcus. There's nothing we can do for her. We've gotta run. Say North. Good job, Connor! Oh, God! God damn it! I just lost Connor. I messed up every single one of those... Quick, come on! Quick time events! Detonated an explosive in the hold. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. It's over, Marcus. This was the crossroads. I know there's a better outcome. There's got to be a mmm. This is your story chart. It shows what parts of the story you've explored and what parts you've missed. You can track the choices made by other players and do many other things besides. You can use this chart to replay from any point in the story, but the people who designed me recommend that you play through at least once without going back, no matter what happens. Either way, it's your story. Hmm. So I could go back and prevent Connor from dying, deviant Connor from dying. Because I have a feeling the new Connor that we get, it's not going to be the same person. And we'll be lucky. We'll be very lucky if we get a happy ending at this point. If we don't get an ending that I'm happy with, I'm going to go back and replay Crossroads and make sure that Connor gets out alive. But that's going to be it for now.
Thank you all so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. And until next time, everyone, I am Poji Force. You all take care. I'll catch you next time.